Hey everyone, it's Nicole. Welcome back to my channel, Relax Cut Glue. If you're new here, welcome. I am so happy to have you all here with me today. So today I'm going to be playing in my big random glue book because I love it and it makes me happy. So today I kind of have this like theme kind of um, a lot of the things I'll be using in here today are red, red and blue. I, it just kind of happens. Um, I've talked about this before where, you know, I'll have, I'll be going through my images and there seems to be like a, like a theme kind of coming together on its own. And that's kind of what happened today. Um, just like I start every, uh, big random glue book, I'll explain a little bit of what this glue book is. It is a sketchbook. It is from Michael's Craft Store. It is their brand, Artist Loft. It is eight and a half by 11 inches. They are always on sale. So if it's not on sale, just wait. It will be probably the next week or the week after that. Um, any sketchbook would work if you wanna do a style like this. Um, any book in general would, general would work. But if you want a spine like this, which I prefer for glue booking because everything lays flat, you don't have to worry about the tight spine. Um, any sketchbook should suffice. So without further ado, uh, pretty soon I'm not going to be able to flip through this because there's just going to be uh, too many pages. Okay, let's get started. So every time I start my big random glue book, I usually add one or two larger images, then a couple medium, and I work my way down. Then I add words and fussy cuts on top of it. All right, well, let's get started. Okay, so I mentioned that I had a lot of things that have red and blue, and I saw this. I've had it for a long time in my little stash. Now that I look at it, I think I might cut this down just a little bit. I don't need all this blue over here. That's kind of a lot. So let's take this down to something more like that. And maybe I'll put this one up here. The reason why I do that is that there's a lot of blank space here and here, and I know I can overlap an image or add fussy cuts or words right there. If I put it like this, it's left me with this, and I can't really go over this as much. I don't know if that even makes sense, but that's why I did what I did. And then I have these, but I also have this, but this is really big, so I'm not sure. I think I'm going to go with the sodas. Let's go with that. Okay, let's start gluing this stuff down. And I usually do opposite corners when I start with my larger images. That's just my process. There's no wrong way or right way to do this. So definitely uh, do what works for you. Okay, now let's get started gluing. I hope everybody's having a good day today. All right, here we go. We're getting started. Yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, this morning I... <laughs> Me and my dogs were, like, attacked by the most aggressive fly I've ever seen in my life. This thing kept, like, dive-bombing us. And, like, it was a big fly, too. So you could, like, hear it flying around. And I didn't get this all the way to the top. But I'm going to try not to worry about it. If it continues to bother me, um, I will just add some washi tape across the top. Uh, anyways, yeah. So it was, like, dive-bombing us. And it woke up Sherman because it kept, like flicking on his ears and his face and stuff and then I it would come up to me on the couch and like go right on my forehead and stuff it would not leave me alone it kept coming back so Zena is our fly catcher well she tries sometimes she gets them sometimes she doesn't but she's always trying to catch them in the air and stuff like that so Zena was on the scene and tried to get the little fly and I kept showing her where it was and like she came up and like protected me she came up and sat right there so she could like get it when it came near me it was the cutest thing I've ever seen I love my dogs um Sherman kind of sat there like what is happening like he was woken up out of a dead sleep he's like I, I this is my nap time what is happening <laughs> it was pretty funny but dang that thing it just kept like dive bombing us little brat jeez who knew that they could be so aggressive? Okay. Um, so my next ones, these are the medium ones that I took out. And I think I like this one, but I would have to cut off part of her head. So I do feel like that one might be a little bit 
See, that just takes up so much space. I don't know if I want to do that. This one's pretty cool. I could do that one and maybe this one. Or I could switch it. Let me see. That one doesn't fit really either. Um, how do I want to work this? I'm not sure if I'm going to be totally honest. Um, okay, I'm just going to put it down. If I like it enough to where I keep second guessing it, I always just put it down. That's just my process because I've learned that if I keep going back to it, I like it on some sort of level because I keep second guessing myself and putting it back. So I just put it down and I'm usually very happy with my decision, you know, once I'm done. Cause I realize, you know what? That wasn't that bad of a decision to put that there. That's just what I do. It just helps me not be so hyper focused on perfectionism because I am a perfectionist and I can get lost in that. And then I'm not enjoying crafting as much, you know? Okay, do I want to add this? I don't know. I don't know. Um, I do like this, and I like this. Do I want to put that over here? I could put that up there. Put the spaghetti. I could actually go both ways, really. I could bring this up a little as well. That's what I'll do. I'll do that. Okay. Um, let's glue this first. Sometimes just getting this stuff down, the like base layer can be the most stressful part of this for me. Um, but I just have to remind myself that basically these are backgrounds and it's okay for them to be covered up. I will be cover covering up some of it. So it's okay. You know what I mean? Actually, maybe I'll go this way and then I can add a word down below. Or washi tape. Okay. And we're gluing. Okay. All right. Oh, wait, I need to do this one. Oh my gosh, you guys, I have the funniest joke. Well, it's not the funniest joke, but I heard this joke yesterday and it's so dumb that I laughed so hard. <laughs> and it's a clean joke, so don't worry. <laughs> I'm sure anybody who knows me is like, oh my gosh, Nicole, be careful. <laughs> it's a clean joke. Okay, here we go. Are you ready? Sorry. What sound does James Bond's doorbell make? I'll give you a second. <laughs> dong. Ding dong. <laughs> like Bond, James Bond. <laughs> you hit his doorbell and it's like dong. Ding dong. <laughs> that is so dumb and I love it. <laughs> dong. Ding dong. <laughs> it's like the more you say it, the funnier it is. <laughs> I laughed so hard. I was like, oh my gosh. I don't know if I'm just sleep deprived or what, but oh my God, I found it so funny. <laughs> dong. Ding dong. <laughs> That's like the more you say it. So go tell somebody that joke today. Do it. Oh man. That is too funny. Oh man. I laughed so hard. Okay. <laughs> dong. Ding dong. I I'm serious. You just can't stop saying it. Okay. So I have some smaller fussy cuts here. Let's just kind of check some of these out. Um, I could put this like food one right here. Oh, yeah, I'll do that because it fits like perfect. Lots of food picks, but there are a lot of color in food, which is why I really like um, 
like food magazines and stuff. Because there's always like, you know, desserts and ice cream and like fun, colorful things. Burgers. You guys know how I am about those. Which way do I want to go here? I think I'll go. I'll go this way just because I get more of that kind of pinky red color. Okay. All right. And everything that's hanging off, I'll cut once I'm done with my base layers. Oh, man. I love jokes. I love it. I like it like that. Oh, of course, that doesn't fit perfectly, and I wanted it to. Maybe I'll just put this flower right here. Although, I need to trim it better to see white on it. Unacceptable. Plus, the flower is not even, and it makes me... Yeah, it's still not even, but that's okay. All right. Um, ooh, I could put it down here, too. Okay, I think I'll do that. <laughs> dong. Ding dong. <laughs> I cracked myself up. Oh my gosh, I love to laugh. It's just so good for your soul. <laughs> ah, life is good. Life is good. Okay. Ooh, I also have this tomato soup, which I thought might be kind of cute too. Does it fit right here? No. Um, oh, I could put it right here. Does it fit? Barely. I'm just going for it. I'm just going to go for it. Okay. There we go. Oops. There. Okay. I'm going to have this Chanel. Maybe I'll put that right here for something a little bit different. Ugh. Oh no, I stuck it on glue. No. Ugh. I hate it when I do that. Um, oh my gosh, this fits perfect. I wonder if I should cut her in half and then I can use her twice. I think I might do that. Oh, and look what I went and did. I cut too much. Oh, actually, this wasn't straight. That's why. I knew something was off with this one. Why I didn't get it to the top. Okay, I'm blaming this. Has nothing to do with my cutting abilities. <laughs> oh, my gosh. All right, here we go. All right, perfect. Okay, and I think I'll just add like a little strip of washi right here. That's why I love washi tape. Okay, let me get something with red in it. Okay, I am going to add a little bit of glue to this because it's not very sticky. I love washi tape. It's a great way to fill up any little lines that you might have. And it's a great way to add a little bit more color, if, especially if you have like a theme going. Okay, I have some spots. What else do we have here? I have, now some of these I can fill up with, um, uh, what do you call it? Fussy cuts and stuff. Ooh, I have this nose with a mouth. Should put that right there. Could put it right there. Could turn the mouth on its side. I'm going to cut off the nose. It's getting a rhinoplasty. Well, a pretty severe one because I'm cutting it completely off. <laughs> oh, man. Don't come to me for plastic surgery. Cutting it all off. Okay, I want to put that there. I do think that looks kind of cool there, though. Okay, perfect, perfect. So now I, all I have are these spots over here, which I'm gonna wait to add my washi to wait and see if my fussy cuts cover all that stuff or not. Okay, I need to cut around my edges really quick. So I'll be right back. I wanna do that and then I will, and then we will do the fussy cutting. All right, I'll be right back. All right, now everything's cut. So, um, oh yeah, I have this purse. 
that I've had that kind of like goes on the side of something. So I could put it right here. I could also put it right here. I don't really want to cut that. I mean, I don't know if I'll use that yet. Okay, so I have her, love her. Do I want to put her there or do I want to put her right here? Ooh, I could put her up here too. Honestly, I could put her right through the spaghetti and that might be what I do. All right, let's put her there. A lot of people get in their lawn mode today. Okay, so we have her. Wasn't sure about that. I also have some vanilla extract, which I could have put right here. I mean, I still can. I can just kind of go like that, right? What else do I have? Oh, I have this jar of like jelly or something. No idea what this is. Salsa or something, I'm not sure. Okay. I also have this watch, which I love. Where should I put that? Right here, maybe? Should I put it up here? Ooh, right here might be good, actually. Or maybe up here. Ooh, let's put it right there. Ooh, this is fun. It's fun when you kind of come, I mean, I guess, I say kind of a theme, because I'm, I'm really not, it's not really a theme theme, but... I just noticed when I was going through my images that I was finding a lot of red. So I'm like, well, let's go with the red and the blue. And then I have Snoop Dio Double G. Do I want to add him on this? Oh, I kind of want to add him. Uh -huh. No, I'm going to do it. I'm going to add him. I'm going to put him right here because he is fire. Do I want to add him there? Yes. Okay, I'm doing it. I'm, do I'm just going to do it. This is one of those instances where I had my to stop myself from hoarding the image it's fine i'll come across more snoop dog photos it's not that big of a deal if you don't know i love snoop <laughs> he's my second husband he just doesn't know it um okay so i do have some words as well oh yeah i had these lips do i want to use these on here or do i want to keep this for like one of my other glue books you know what i mean we'll see Oh, and I have lipsticks. Okay, so those, oh, here, betting on red. I'll put that right here. Look, it fits perfect. This is why I don't worry about those little thin strips because I know I can add a word or washi later or, you know, something, another paper strip. Okay, let's put that. You can hear Sherman. He's in here now because that fly got him all worked up and awake this morning. Okay, so betting on red. We got that. I have the word guess. Put that right there. Let's do that. I'm wondering. I have two lipsticks. Sorry, I am going to put that there. But I'm looking up here. And I'm wondering if I put it upside down. Could I cover some of that? Or if I went this way? Not with this one. What about this one? No, not really. Okay. Um, what was I doing? I was going to put guess right here. Okay. You guys, guess what's back? The glue crew know this already, but my speed trap came back. Um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I live in a residential area. Um, you know, I live in a neighborhood. And for some reason, people just speed like crazy. And so they put like a speed radar machine outside my house and it was here for a week and then it went away to like three blocks down and now it's back again after a week so that's exciting however it is still in front of my house but it's this way instead of this way so now I can't see the the time or you know the numbers on it when people drive by darn it I was telling the glue crew I almost went out there when the guy was putting it there and asked him if he could move it over a little bit <laughs> not even joking but he had already had it like disconnected from his truck and was already you know like by the time I noticed it was even there so I didn't I wasn't gonna ask him to do that after he had already done all that work you know what I mean and he probably would have just said uh, no I'm gonna put this right here just to get rid of that little tiny spot but I'm gonna offset it yeah I like that 
I will say it was the same guy, um, cause it's the city that I live in that does it. It's the same guy. We had, um, somebody that had like a RV, but they were not good people who kind of go from neighborhood to neighborhood and they just park there and they won't leave and they do bad things and fight throughout the night and it's just crazy anyways these guys would not leave and he finally did get them to leave which was nice they were like coming up to my neighbor's house in the middle of the night and like ringing their doorbell because they were intoxicated it was just crazy should i put good right here cheesy good i need something else that goes right here what about taste Would taste fit better not really okay um, so I'm going to put a piece of washi right here just to block out some of that. Okay. Wow. It got so dark all of a sudden. It must be a, ready to pour or something. Okay. I'm having so much fun with this. Ooh, I have this little blue book that I just cut out this morning that I thought would be kind of cute. Um, should I add that there? I also have this big red. Could just kind of. I don't know if I need to even use that. Oh, I did want to use, um, good. I should put good right here. Damn right he's good. <laughs> good looking. Just kidding. Okay. All right. There we go. Snoop Deal Double G is good. All right. Let's add some lipstick where was the other oh it's right here okay i have this lipstick should i put it i can still put it right here let's do that that looks kind of cool that looks cute anybody gonna watch football tonight i know not not everybody likes football or sports i love it i hate that you have to watch it on prime though because it always like legs and stuff it's awful I put it like that where it's like good taste yeah let's do it Ooh, this is so fun if you have a big random blue book um i suggest you play in it today because it is so much fun i'm having a blast or any glue book for that matter i am thoroughly enjoying it good taste okay we have that i want more fun stuff over here too i wonder if i should put this lipstick Actually, I could have it going across her her feet right here. That's kind of weird, isn't it? Um, what about... I'm Vanilla Baby. <laughs> I was just about to go into a little song, but I'm not going to do it. All right. Let's add this. Where did I have it? Like that. Okay, and then I had my little book, which I did think was super cute. Should I put my little book right there? That's what I'll do. There you go, little book. Definitely cut out little books when you see them. Um, they're just kind of a great little filler. I still want to use this lipstick. Should I put it right here? No. Um... Where do I want to put it? No. I mean, I could. You know what? Why not? Let's do it. You don't have to use the whole image. Look, I cut that one in half. I cut images in half all the time. If you've been watching me for any amount of time, you'll know. I love to do that because you get more use out of one image. Right? Because you have two of them. This is what I should put right here. Mwah. Mm. Okay, Nicole, stop. We know. We know you're obsessed with Snoop. Okay. Ooh, we have an eye. Do we want to add an eyeball somewhere? I don't know. Oh, and I have this hard-boiled egg. Random, I know, but it's just another... <clears throat> Whoa, what happened to my voice there? <laughs> um, it's just another, like, little element, you know, to... To bring to the party do i want to add it there do i want this lady looking at an egg in the sky do i want to just put it right here so it looks like it's part of this meal that's what i'll do 
Charmin is snoring. Okay, let's do that. Let's put that right there. Okay, got a little egg. All right, I don't want to use these healthy bars. I'm going to save these lips for my collage card glue book, I think, because I don't know. Normally, I wouldn't cover up color, but I kind of feel like it does add a little something, something. Oh, I should have had something coming out of the little hole right there. Darn it. That did not sound right. But if you're watching, <laughs> you're just listening. <laughs> Yikes. Okay. Okay. I'll just put that right there. Um, Anything else? Cute dog. Strawberry. Those are red. Ooh, red flags in the beginning are red flags forever. It's another play on red. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put this red flags thing right here because I feel like it fits really well right there and it breaks it up just a little bit. I want it to go over onto that just a little bit. All right, we'll do that. Oh, that's good. Okay, then we have strawberry. I could just put it. Honestly, I probably put a, would have put it right there if I didn't have, guess, the most romantic. Serving up delicious. I'm going to put it right there. I feel like that makes everything look better over there. Let's do that. Serving up delicious. Okay. Ah. Oh, no. That feels really crooked to me. Let it go, Nicole. Okay, I'm letting it go. Walk away. Um, I really like this come and get it, but it's not cut very well. Where are my scissors? What the heck? Oh, right here. I literally have like a thousand pairs of scissors around me, but you know, you have to have the right ones. So come and get it. I think I'm going to cut it. It just takes up more real estate that way and makes it more interesting. Wouldn't have to tell me twice, Snoop. <laughs> wow. Okay, come and get it. Ah. Uh, okay, come and get it. Um, and then we have a strawberry. I'm gonna put it right there. Again, it breaks the image up because it's just meant to be for a background. Just adds more interest and takes your eye all around the page. Strawberry. Okay, and then I have the most romantic. I don't know if I want to put that there. Oh, yeah. I'll put that right there. Okay, I like that better. Today's your day to shine on. Yes. All right, everyone. So I ended up just putting the most romantic right there because I just needed something there and nothing was looking right. And that looks right to me. So I'm going to call it a day. I absolutely had so much fun with this page. Well, pages, because I do a double page layout for mine. I hope you guys had fun hanging out with me today while I played in my big random glue book. I hope you guys all have a fabulous day. Don't forget to drink your water. Give this video a like. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye, friends.